Hey, uh, King Have Charles says, petition to let D.E. Marcus host a stream and bless us with his supreme goofiness. Well, you're going to be pleasantly surprised if you tune in to Monday, 1 p.m. Eastern Time, because Marcus Kretz will be gracing your screens on a Monday stream next week. So you can look forward to that. I'm looking forward to it. We are all looking forward to it. Does he know about that or did he just find out now? Says someone in chat. <laughs> Dear Marcus. No, no, he knows. He's ready. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the first ever time I am hosting a stream. I've been here before. Some of you may recognize me. My name is D.E. Marcus. I am on the community team. I am a senior community coordinator. You would have maybe heard me on one of these live streams before. If you've ever gone, who's that guy in the background that we don't see except on sometimes special occasions? That's me. This is Marcus. YouTube chat. I could see that you were very confused. This is me. Uh, I'm a senior community coordinator. As I said, I work on the creator program with DE Taylor and DE Spacey Sarah. And you've probably just seen me here or there in the community. I'm around, I'm here, I'm doing stuff. But yeah, it's my first stream. Welcome to my humble abode. And enough about that, it's enough about me. Let's get into some Warframe. So we are currently in MoFrame 2020. As you can see, my Wisp has a lovely mustache adorned right now. Uh, so the Warframe stashes are actually back in the market until Monday, November 30th. So until then, so you can buy any of these lovely mustaches. I'm a big fan of the Tuskard because it's so so meaty. Uh, finally, because this is my because this is my first stream, uh, some of you may remember a few weeks ago I streamed with De Rebecca uh, on PC as well. That was very challenging to play bounties as well as read chat. So I'm gonna do my best with chat today. I promise I will read my read your comments as best as I can. But I am only one man, so I will do my best. But bear with me, and I'm sure I will improve with time because I remember the first time I saw Twitch chat, it was just uh, it was just it was just a mess. So today on Demos, we're gonna be playing some bounties. I am not as high of rep. In in Deimos as I would like to be. I want to be in with the family, but I'm not in enough. So I will be running some bounties. Uh, YouTube, if you type in exclamation point plat, that won't do anything. I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish it did. It does not. Da, 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 da. IGN. Oh, this is much harder. Swell. Go sell ribbon. All right. <laughs> Marcus, why don't you grow out a mustache? Excellent question. I actually grew a beard for six months in quarantine and uh, did not feel like doing that again, but I will support any Movember campaigns I see uh, as best as I can. Marcus, what happened to Megan? But the prettiest sight to see. Megan's still here. She'll actually be streaming tomorrow, so do not worry, you're not missing out on your uh, on your time with Megan. All righty. Is the playlist on YouTube? The playlist is actually, if you pay attention to the bar on the bottom, It'll pop up and we have all of our Tenno tunes available online. Oh, we need, my loadout is interesting. I was wondering who was gonna be the first person to say that. My loadouts are interesting. It's kind of like, you know when you have company over and your mom's like, clean up your room. And you're like, who's gonna see my room? That's kind of how I felt about my arsenal. I was like, no one's gonna see this, come on. I was like, I just need good functional loadouts uh, to play the game. Turns out everyone's gonna see them today. I kind of felt the same way about my orbiter as well. I was like, gee, I really need to uh, clean up around here. And uh, I did not. Now here's a big thing, chat. This is what I do, clean a room, Anji. I, listen, I did clean this bookshelf. That is the one thing I did. One step at a time, small, small victories. All right, what bounty are we going to run today? I haven't done the steel path one yet. That's a bit ambitious. You know what, let's start off, let's off mid tier. Let's do brute force, let's do brute force. Ooh, a new face, it is a new face. Thunder Alley, the funny thing, so Thunder Alley is my amp for anybody that's paying attention and checking out my loadouts. I thought Thunder Alley was like the coolest name. I'm pretty sure it's the it's the place they go to in the movie Grease where it's like, uh, where they do the, the car races. I thought it was so cool, I was like, yeah, Thunder Alley, I'm so original. I can think of this cool name until, oh, and we got a predacite. So you can get weakened predacites and weakened vulpophilus for anyone who's paying attention at home. Both of those can be turned into companions if you visit Sun. Uh, just be sure you have enough rep and 10, so 10 Sun tokens uh, to build a new companion. So I thought I was so cool with the Amp Thunder Alley until I was driving home one day and I saw that there's a go-kart track called Thunder Alley. And that's where I'd seen it and subconsciously gone, oh yeah, Thunder Alley, that's the coolest. So yes, my amp is named after a go-kart uh, amusement place. Lots of fun. I name all of my modular stuff after Final Fantasy summons. There's more than you think. Honestly, F Final Fantasy is a very in-depth franchise that I've not gone into enough, but I can almost be certain there's enough cool names in there to keep you keep you busy for a while. Nice to see a face with the voice. Yes, 
This is my voice. Uh, some people have thought that I have voiced a character in game. I have not. Uh, however, I probably have a just similar sounding voice, so who knows what that could be. Hey Marcus, never seen you before. Who's your favorite Warframe? That's really tough. I would say that Zephyr was my favorite for a very long time, and then I played a ton of Nezha. I also played a ton of- I kind of go in waves of playing Warframes. If I had to do all-time favorite, it would probably be Zephyr, followed very closely by uh, Nezha. So, my red text. Nobody knows who red text is, so I can neither confirm nor deny the identity or identities of red text. Who knows? And then, uh, oh, I am nowhere near anybody else. Let's get going. Hi from France. Bonjour. Bonsoir. All right. Bring the thunder. You mean the thunder alley? Hell yeah. Always got a soft spot for them. All right. Oh, I was not doing the bounty correctly. Chat, don't look at that. I swear I know the rules and I know to kill them inside the bubble. Just, just don't look at that. Oh, we finished our bounty. Oh, look at that. All right, here we go. Oh, okay. All right, let's go Latrox. Teamwork makes the dream work. I will say I do have a ton of fun. Oh, and we got a purple blossom pod. Thanks for the tag. Uh-oh, Robert. It is a slippery snake. Uh-oh, am I gonna die? Hmm, good question. I would never presume to talk smack about Nidus. Nailed it. It's a very high likelihood that uh, my camera could be doing some some odd things. Almost there. No! Close, 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 close. We're close, chat. We are very close. Boop, 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 boop. GG, everyone. GG, indeed. So, what, what am I doing here? Boop, boop, boop. Marcus getting Arcwing. I do have an Arcwing. It is a... It's all. Haven't used it a ton, but I'm going to soon. I do arbitration for an hour. I would die <laughs> very quickly. Just bear with me on this. We've got Kavats and Kubros. These are the most Kavat looking Kubros and Kubro looking Kavats. Try that on for size. Mother! Let's do the big boy. We've got 15 minutes left. Should be enough time. Your master rank does not dictate how skillful you, skillful you are at the game. Oh! It did get their attention, Lloyd. Do not worry about your master rank. Uh, it does not correlate to your skill level. Game. Oh, game, game. Good work with the stream. Thank you. I would like to think I it's going well so far. Not superstitious, but I also don't mess with superstitions. Tell me about it, Nora. I bet Nora throws the coolest parties. Guaranteed. Guaranteed she does. Nora Nightclub? Heck yeah. I would love to join the Nora Nightclub. Uh oh. Don't die. West Fetcher support. Latrox, my boy. Marcus is real? I know. I am not an apparition. I'm not like a, you know, it's like, I don't know. If you guys have seen the IT crowd, I am not like Richmond. Noel Fielding, what a talent. Who managed to set a new world record after spending 71 days crying in the B&Q? <laughs> Richard and Noel, what have you put as your answer to this question? Your mum. <laughs> but uh, no, no, I do exist. I am a real person. I, I kind of expected one of my cats to show up at one point and start meowing extremely loudly. They may make an appearance at some point, but uh, we shall see. 100 points for the IT crowd reference. Well, there's many more where that came from. <laughs> Unfortunately or fortunately, I, I'm personally a big a big fan of, uh, of the IT crowd, but I know it's not everyone's cup of tea, but uh, I'm a huge fan and I do own the box set. So how many hours do I have in Warframe? I am approaching a thousand hours, I'm pretty sure. I'm approaching a thousand hours. I typically will only play during the workday. I've got a massive backlog of, uh, one second. Uh. I've got a massive backlog of games outside of Warframe that I just need to uh, end up playing. So I just finished uh, The Last of Us and I'm looking to play The Last of Us Part 2, just playing Breath of the Wild as well. So outside of work, I will typically stick to other games just to, you know, play through God of War I still have to play. So Warframe I will typically play just uh, just during the workday at different times. But yeah, so I will say my hours probably don't reflect how far I am, but I usually when I'm playing it's pretty, pretty targeted. I only play during the workday, lol, lucky. Yeah, very sparingly. Like I maybe play, you know, I, I will try to squeeze in a couple missions depending on how busy my day is. Sometimes it's slightly more, sometimes it's less, uh, depending on what's going on. All right, someone's asking Rebecca a question. I'm not Rebecca, but you may summon her. How do you know everyone's playtime off the top of your head? I don't know, she's, Reb knows things, you know? I don't know if you've, I mean, I mean, I'm sure if you're watching this right now, you've seen Rebecca on a stream, but she's, uh. Well, actually, I will say for certain. Oh, we're done our bounty. Look at that. Hey, and look at that. 159. Chat. Boom. Perfect timing. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I went the wrong way. Casey, I see you in YouTube chat. Hey, Casey, good to see you. Oh, I mean, I guess, you know. Ooh, I hope you're all excited. All right, so I've got my Arioli mutagen and my... Oh, did I not build an antigen? I am a giddy goat. 
So typically, if you wanted to build a Vulpophila, you would craft an antigen and a mutagen. However, I built two mutagens in my haste. Can he type not that fast? All right, so if you had both a mutagen and an antigen, Here's where you go. You got a Vulpophila. Got a few. Yeah, yeah, no big deal. I've been, you know, been doing my stuff. Let's do Sly. And then do I have antigen? Nope, I do not. So you want to craft a mutagen and an antigen. And if I had one, I would go, oh, here it is. Click, click, click. And then uh, and then you can build. You can check out what your Vulpophila looks like. And then you would be able to click this guy. So that's what you want to do. But without further ado, that will be it for me today. And so thank you all so much for joining me today. Uh, I had a great time. Uh, chat as always it's a pleasure spice must flow perfect all right thank you everybody i will hopefully see you soon all right bye bye spice must flow <laughs> warframe thank you for the host of sixteen thousand people i'm so happy marcus you were the cause of the spice must flow and i knew it 